nitrogen cycle. What is nitrogen used for? Nitrogen forms an essential part of amino acids which make up proteins and DNA. Nitrogen is essential for all living cells. Air, which is about 78% nitrogen gas, is the major reservoir of nitrogen. But most organisms cannot use nitrogen in this form. Plants must secure their nitrogen in fixed form, that is, incorporated in compounds such as nitrate ions, NO3, in negative, ammonia, NH3, urea, NH2, 2, CO. Animals secure their nitrogen and all other compounds from plants or animals that have fed on plants. What is nitrogen cycle? Four processes that participate in the cycling of nitrogen through the biosphere constitute the nitrogen cycle. They are nitrogen fixation, decay, nitrification, denitrification. Role of microorganisms Microorganisms play a major role in all four processes of the nitrogen cycle. Nitrogen fixation The nitrogen molecule N2 is quite inert. To break it apart so that its atoms can combine with other atoms requires the input of substantial amounts of energy. Three processes are responsible for most of the nitrogen fixation in the biosphere. Atmospheric fixation by lightning. Biological fixation by certain microbes, alone or in a symbiotic relationship with plants. Industrial fixation. Atmospheric fixation. The enormous energy of lightning breaks nitrogen molecules and enables their atoms to combine with oxygen in the air forming nitrogen oxides. These dissolve in rain forming nitrates that are carried to the earth. Atmospheric nitrogen fixation probably contributes some 5 to 8 percent of the total nitrogen fixed. Industrial fixation under great pressure at a temperature of 600 degrees centigrade and with the use of a catalyst, atmospheric nitrogen and hydrogen, usually derived from natural gas or petroleum, can be combined to form ammonia NH3. Ammonia can be used directly as a fertilizer, but most of it is further processed to urea and ammonium nitrate NH4NO3. Biological fixation. The ability to fix nitrogen is found only in certain bacteria. Some live in a symbiotic relationship with plants of the legume family. Example, soybeans, alfalfa. Some establish symbiotic relationships with plants other than legumes. Example, alders. Some nitrogen fixing bacteria live free in the soil. Nitrogen-fixing cyanobacteria are essential for maintaining the fertility of semi-aquatic environments like rice paddies. Biological nitrogen fixation requires a complex set of enzymes and a huge expenditure of ATP. Although the first stable product of the process is ammonia, this is quickly incorporated into protein and other organic nitrogen compounds. Decay. The proteins made by plants enter and pass through food webs, just as carbohydrates do. At each trophic level, their metabolism produces organic nitrogen compounds that return to the environment, chiefly in excretions. The final beneficiaries of these materials are microorganisms of decay. They break down the molecules in excretions and dead organisms into ammonia. Nitrification Ammonia can be taken up directly by plants, usually through their roots. However, most of the ammonia produced by decay is converted into nitrates. This is accomplished in two steps. 
Bacteria of the genus Nitrosomonas oxidize NH3 to nitrites, NO2 negative. Bacteria of the genus Nitrobacter oxidize the nitrites to nitrates, NO3 negative. These two groups or autotrophic bacteria are called nitrifying bacteria. Through their activities, which supply them with all their energy needs, nitrogen is made available to the roots of plants. Many legumes, in addition to fixing atmospheric nitrogen, also perform nitrification, converting some of their organic nitrogen to nitrites and nitrates. These reach the soil when they shed their leaves. Denitrification the three processes, nitrogen fixation, nitrification and decay described so far remove nitrogen from the atmosphere and pass it through ecosystems. Denitrification reduces nitrates to nitrogen gas, thus replenishing the atmosphere. Once again, bacteria are the agents. They live deep in soil and in aquatic sediments where conditions are anaerobic. They use nitrates as an alternative to oxygen for the final electron acceptor in their respiration. Thus they close the nitrogen cycle. Click on the summary button to view the role of microorganisms in nitrogen cycle. Microorganisms involved in nitrogen cycle when we cause nitrogen overload in an ecosystem, there are many drastic effects. These are enlisted here. 